That from Wash House across the road. I took my tractor forklift and brought it over here and put it there for a bone. This is Mr. Isaiah <laughs> Lucas. He's 80 year old man. <laughs> Uh, from Newington, Georgia, where it lived right around the corner from me. He's giving me the lowdown on all the goats. He got chickens over here, and he got some hogs over here in his back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This is his whole little setup. I'm, I, this is what I'm going to be when I grow up. <laughs> he got, uh, you got the tractors and all that, you know? And uh, he's teaching me about sugar cane, which is a thumbs up. I, that's definitely what I want to do. And, uh, you know, just other little yeah. stuff, man. And this is his little setup with, yeah. with the barn. So I got to figure out what and I'm going to do. I had quails in this. Wow. Right there, I had food quails. Wow. And, but I killed them and put them in the freezer. Wow. Oh. And my grand loved them better than I did. They had quails in my kids. I was about to say, because your kids done bonded with them. Yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. I go over there, um, go sell over there, and I get them coils and raise them. Oh, at the at the auction. Auction. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna go down there. there. Yeah. Yep. I go at limes over there. Limes. Okay. Yeah, after I get my goat, take my goat, and get. Mm -hmm. But that fella for to come back at that goat there, he's gonna give me two hundred for him. I really don't want to get it. He want the other one. He want to give me two for that and one for that. Yeah, but he ain't gonna do that. If he want me to give me two a piece. Then. Two a piece. That's right. Uh, them little goats over there, I tell you, the last time I've been that goat here, a goat on the ball, a little goat sucking the ball, a hundred dollars. Wow. They high. They, they getting the high. The goats over a whole pile now. Yeah. They don't take a goat pile. Okay.